find the LCM and HCF of 20, 40 and 100. To find the HCF and LCM, first we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. What I mean is C. 20, 40 and 100. Okay, next. Here first number is 20, 20 is 5 4 is 20, 4 is 2 2 is 4. Now we have 2 2 is a prime number so 2 1 is 2. Okay, now the other number 40, 40 is 5 8 is 40, 8 is 2 4 is 8, 4 is 2 2 is 4. Now we have 2, 2 is a prime number, so 2, 1 is 2. Now the other number, 100. Last digit 0, so we take 5 here. The first number 1 smaller than 5, so we take 2 numbers, that is 10. When do we get 10 in 5 table? 5, 2 is 10. This 0 as it is down. Now here we have 20, 20 is 5, 4 is 20. 4 is 2, 2 is 4. Now we have 2, 2 is a prime number, so 2, 1 is 2. Now our HCF is, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present over here and here and also here. I repeat, HCF is the product of numbers which should be present in these three places here here and also here so now let us find the numbers which are present here here and also here starting with the number 5 do we have 5 here yes go to the next place do we have 5 here yes so you cut 5 right here Next number 2, do we have 2 here? Yes. Next place, do we have 2 here? Yes. So you cut 2 right here. Next number 2, do we have 2 here? Yes. Next place, do we have 2 here? Yes. So you cut 2 right here. No more numbers have been left. Therefore, our HCF is 5 into 2, 10, into 2, 20, 20 is our HCF, HCF. Now to get LCM, whatever HCF we got, to that we should multiply by the numbers which appeared either once or twice in these three places. What I mean is C. Over here each number has been cut, here 2 is not cut. Do we have 2 here? No. 2 is present in only one place, still you cut 2 right here. Now here 5 is not cut, you cut 5 and right here. Now each number has been cut, therefore our LCM is 20 into 2, 40 into 5, 200 is our LCM. Am I clear?